Mammals follows the story of Jamie, a Michelin star chef whose world implodes when he discovers the shocking secrets about his pregnant wife. Jamie finds himself hunting for answers. Will he find them? Well, we're going to find out because what starts off as a romantic getaway quickly escalates into a dark comedy drama which explores the truth at the heart of modern relationships. And joining me by Zoom is the star of Mammals, James Corden. James, how are you doing this morning? I'm very well, Brad. I'm very much am. How are you? Uh, I am. Listen, I'm, uh, I'm in trouble because I was given this yesterday to watch and I stayed in my office. I locked the door because I could not stop watching this series. And it's only it's a, only six part series. But you are amazing this and it catches you right off from the start. But let's talk about this because this kind of story hits home for a lot of people, especially after the pan after the pandemic. Oh, well, firstly, thank you very much, Brad. That is incredibly kind that you would say that. Um, yes, it, it does feel like it's the type of show that when people it, when people find the first episode, uh, it does it lends itself to binging all of it kind of at once, really. It's a, it's a really interesting show, which is written by the writer of the new Indiana Jones, and he wrote Skyfall and Spectre and Ford versus Ferrari. So if you like those kinds of movies, then you will, um, you'll appreciate that the show just twists and turns all the time and you never quite know what the truth is in any of it. I know, and, and literally after the first episode, I was like, oh no, this is, is interesting. We don't want to give too much away because people have to watch, especially if you're on the holiday break, you're going to want to watch the show. But let's get into a little bit of things because it's really not just about Jamie, your character in this, it's also about Jamie's brother-in-law uh, has some problems going on too. Yes, well, every character really, as the show goes on, you realize is incredibly flawed and has their own issues. And the cast is uh, brilliant. It's me and um, Sally Hawkins, who's been nominated for two Oscars, and Malia Crelly and Colin, Colin Morgan. And it's uh, it's really just a show about love and the things that, that bind us all together. But I do feel like it's probably the perfect show to watch in this moment between kind of Christmas and New Year where you never quite know what day it is and uh, and to curl up on a on a couch and and watch a show like this is is kind of the perfect thing to do really yeah and and what's really great uh James is that it reminds us of your acting chops because before you were doing late night talk you were acting and we've known throughout the year you've done stuff but this really shows off your acting chops i was just so amazed at at your performance in this oh, thank you so much Brad i'm i'm really proud of it i'm really I'm really, really proud of the show, and and I, I feel incredibly blessed to to be in it, and 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 it means a great deal to me that you would that you would say that. Obviously, I know that for the last sort of eight years or so, I've just been I've been hosting a, a show, so I appreciate that it's it might feel like a, a leap or a stretch to suddenly see me in a different way, but um, I, I feel like the, the script is so good. He's such a brilliant writer that. Um, that it all sort of lives and breathes there, and, yeah. and, it, and I'm thrilled when anybody finds it and likes it. Well, James, I'll tell you, it's an amazing series. It's Mammals. It's on uh, Prime right now. People have to check it out, and I thank you for joining us. Uh, and I know you're very tired. You're across the pond there, but thank you for joining us this morning. Never too tired for you, Brad. Never, <laughs> ever, ever. I hope we get to speak very, very soon. I really do. Thank you, My James. love. Thanks. See you, man.